morning YouTube this is Spock today uh, I'm gonna show you how to install Windows 10 technical preview on any x86 tablet and I have a tablet here in front of me and this is a Android tablet let me show it to you let me start it up real fast as you can see here Android is starting up but I'm gonna remove Android so you know I'm gonna kill the bits I'm not even gonna let it start Android I'm just gonna kill it so like that and um, well I created uh, a bootable USB stick here it is and uh, I'm gonna hit F11 to select a boot device and up here you can see that I can boot up from the USB so that's what we're gonna do we're just gonna boot from the USB and there you see Windows 8 installer will start it will be a straight up uh, install and of course this will be for tablets so this is like the tablet version I'm installing now so we'll have to uh, do some uh, choices I think it will also see that this is a tablet version but we'll have to see about that and uh, this is uh, done on the on the um, on the Fusonic tablet the Fusonic Fupet 10 it's a very nice tablet it's a x86 tablet so that is important you need the x86 tablet and if you um, if you want you can also use a mouse or you know external keyboard so here you see we are in the menu we're just gonna hit next we're gonna hit install now by the way the touch screen is now also working and uh, this tablet is not being sold anymore it came with Android 1.6 and Windows 7 starter um, yeah that was like <laughs> really too much for the 16 gigabyte hard drive uh, this thing has only 16 gigabyte uh, hard drive this was uh, yeah the how you can how can you say this the the competitor of the iPad 1 it was the the answer to the iPad 1 at that time this was a very very expensive tablet this tablet costed over 500 euros so you know this is not some stupid tablet some cheap 98 dollar tablet no this is a very very good tablet up here we are just gonna uh, delete the Android partitions and we are gonna delete that one too so we see one partition you see that now we just have one partition we deleted all the partitions cause we are gonna do a brand new fresh clean install of uh, Windows 10 so now we just hit enter and now uh, the files will be copied and after this process is done I will get back to you in fact it went so fast I just uh, was shaving and I came back and I saw that I missed the reboot so um, sorry about that but we're back and uh, the system is installed and now we're just gonna let it do uh, and get ready and I'm gonna put some after shave because I just shave my head man you know when you shave your head you must always finish it with some good aftershave it will burn but you know it will keep your face in good shape hell yeah okay so this is my third Windows 10 system here in my house yep yep this will be my Windows 10 tablet so um, yes we are uh, just letting it go and in the meanwhile we can take the time to get some coffee
my daily bread. But minded one who see me dead, work hard for my daily bread. Pray them, I pray them, I pray me. So the whole world want to see me. Pray them, I pray them, I pray me. Who will come for through me? Pray them, I pray them, I pray me. Mm, who they come for teach me? Pray them, I pray them, I pray me. Mm, right, you know. Mm, don't you know? Don't you know? Don't you know? Oh, they love me, and they love me, and they love me, love me. Pray them, I pray them, I pray me, till the whole world wants to see me. All right, I think this is it, uh, my cool uh, Windows friends. I think this is it. And now you see we do get to the black screen. We saw that also with the laptops. And now probably, um, you know, I don't know what's going to happen. We'll have to see about that. Where is my blood clock? Oh, here it is. So, there you go, baby. You see that? This is a... Uh, no. Skip this test. Customize. Touch is fully working. It's uh, just fine. What I'm doing now is just uh, some personal stuff you shouldn't uh, worry about. You don't have to do this, what I'm doing. You should leave it open, I think. But I don't leave it open. And this is my tablet. 48. Finalizing the settings. So let's see what's going to happen and where we're going to get into. Because this is a tablet, eh? Hi. We're going to set up your beautiful little tablet. There you go, baby. So... This is like the, yeah, this is the tablet version. Well, I think this is the PC version because I think uh, maybe I had to, well, there's the keyboard. This thing is fully working uh, without uh, anything, you know, and in fact, you can remove the keyboard now. This is just, uh, how you call it, a build uh, 8941. Of course, this is Windows 10. And uh, we can, of course, connect to the internet. That is a common thing to do. Let's go for it. So there we go, my, my, my cool friends. My friends. Here we go. And you can see we are connected. So now, in fact, uh, we have internet and everything works. You know, so this is how to install uh, Windows 10 on any tablet, any x86 tablet. If you don't know what's x86, you must check it out. But uh, yeah, in a simple way, I can tell you uh, that x86 is a system that uh, will uh, also run MS-DOS Windows based uh, program programs um, most uh, computers that you see all computers running windows they are x86 systems or x64 systems but in fact that only has to do with the processor you know one has a 32-bit processor and the other one 64-bit processor and in fact this thing also has a 64-bit processor it has the anthem processor those are 64-bit it's a dual core but um, I installed the 32-bit on it because I have only two gigabytes of RAM in this tablet, so makes no sense to install 64-bit. This is not Linux. So this is how to install, um, yeah, uh, Windows 10 on any x86 tablet. I hope this video helped you out. If you like this video, of course, hit that like and subscribe to my channel. Until my next Windows 10 video, bye bye.